Hey everybody, what's up? Tori here. Um, I am just sitting in my living room now. Um, and I mentioned in my last video that I was making little um, cancer ribbons here. Um, I'll show you my cat too. He's sitting right over here. Lakota! There he is. <laughs> He's just staring. Okay. But as I mentioned, I'm making these little um, cancer ribbons, which if you can see that there. Uh, my camera, I swear, sucks at focusing. I apologize, guys. I always try so hard to get this to focus good, and it never wants to listen. <sighs> okay, anyways. <laughs> um, but as you see, it's a cancer ribbon, and it's for ovarian cancer. And the actual color for ovarian cancer is teal. Um, now, I do not have any actual teal rubber bands. This one, I don't know if you can really tell or not. Um, but the yeah, you can kind of see it there. This is actually a combination of like a dark blue and a dark green that I used to make the teal, which from a distance it looks quite teal actually. Um, but I only made a few of them like this because I didn't have a lot of rubber bands like that. Because like I bought my rubber bands in like a combo pack. And then I also have this one, which I guess is a little bit more of a um, turquoise color, I guess, maybe. Or like a... Like, I don't know. It's, it's more of a light blue. It's not a true teal. Like, as if you can see here, this is my band that I have, my bracelet. It says, No One Fights Alone. This is a true teal. And this is definitely not a true teal. It's really, really, like, light blue. But when you put the two of these together, like, you can see a definite difference, but, like, it's not super, super obvious. So, I don't know. I've been making these. Oops, I just threw that one on the floor. I'm going to pick it up. <laughs> so, I've been making these, um, and I'm going to give them to, like, friends and family if they want them. And if you guys would like one, too, you can send me a personal message, um, or a PM, as most of you call it. But you can send me a message, and I'd be happy to send you guys one, too. Um, I'll send you one in the mail. Um, and um, I'm not going to ch force you to pay anything for them, but if you feel obligated, you may gladly send me something for them. I mean, you know, I definitely, if I would charge for them, I would not charge a lot. Like, definitely, probably, I wouldn't, I'm not even sure if I would charge a full dollar. I would say a dollar would be the most expensive I charge, but I don't even think I would charge that if I would charge anything. So, if you guys are interested in having a teal um, ribbon made out of rubber bands with a um, rainbow loom type thing, this is my loom, it's not an actual rainbow loom, but um, that's what they're made from. And um, if you guys are interested, you can send me a PM with your address and I will gladly send you guys one and then I will say if you want to pay for pay me something for it you may but it is not required you do not have to um you know obviously it would be nice I would give it right to my mom but um yeah I'm not going to make it a requirement so um yeah I just wanted to make a quick little video about that just because um you know just in support for my mom and my family is, like, going all out. Um, we're doing a fundraiser. A bunch of my family members are going to shave their heads. And we've sold T-shirts. And um, the youth ministry that I'm a part of that I help out with is um, doing a fundraiser as well it, to um, just help with medical bills because medical bills are ridiculous. I mean, for my mom to go in just for one treatment, not one round of treatments, one treatment, is over four thousand dollars for one treatment and we don't have that money especially because my mom can't work right now I mean she I mean she could potentially but the problem is because she's a nurse and with her white blood cell counts being down lower than normal with having chemo um, she can't necessarily work so yeah it's kind of a hard one with her particular job but um my dad is the only one that works right now um, you know, I do babysitting and stuff like that. I'm trying to get a more full-time job that I'm making more money so I can maybe help out too and potentially get a house of maybe like an apartment or something of my own or even rent an apartment with a friend or something. I don't know. <laughs> 
but so that way I that way I'm not a burden but um but yeah so money is definitely tight so that's why I'm saying you know if you guys would like one just to show your love and support you can let me know and I will gladly send you guys one and then sending money you do not have to do not feel like you have to at all just I don't want to make you guys feel like that is something you need to do because you don't. Um, if you feel like you really need to, you may. Um, but, yeah. Um, and then also, um, I've only ever had one person ask me about the P.O. Box thing. Um, I do not have one. I do not plan to get one unless I have, I would say, probably at least a thousand subscribers before I would even consider a P.O. Box. Just because a P.O. Box costs money, which I do not have. So... But if you do want to send me something, um, you know, just send me a personal message. And again, I will um, consider giving you my address if you feel like you need to send me something or um, anything like that. So, yep, that's it for this video. Um, thank you guys for watching. And um, continue to keep my mom and my family in your prayers. It is greatly appreciated. Thank you so much, guys. Bye.